Okay, for the internet idea, here is a great site uh, called Museum Bob. I recently set up an account. It takes ooh, it took me about three to four weeks to get my account completely done. Um, but what it is is a free site. That's another bonus here. And it allows you to create a box, like a cube, and have different things on each side of it for all different types of topics you can use it for. But let me show you an example. So I'll go to Museum Boxes. And this is one I did for, uh, for Russell Boulevard. So I'm going to type in Russell. You have to uh, sign up for find the school. You have to sign up through school. And there's Russell Boulevard. And we'll see if there's one that I did as a sample. Should load here any moment, but you can look through all all kinds of schools and look at their examples. Oh, there it is, famous island. That's by me. Did it on the sixth of January. So, what what we're doing is the kids are doing famous Missourian. So I did a famous island as an example. John Wayne, you little varmint. That's my impression. And you click on it. So the kids are going to uh, they can do one box uh, cube two cubes, three cubes, etc. For this sample, they're just doing one cube, different things on each side. Uh, we have a little coding guide ready, so here's my box. So anyone could look at this. So I did an image on one side, and the people will be able to uh, click on the different parts. So this one I did, where are you from, Winterset? I did a little recording of John Wayne. One side, I have some quotes uh, about John Wayne. And another side, I have my facts that I paraphrase from uh, different sources. And this last side, I didn't actually complete it the way I should have, but it's a, you can link Word documents or PDFs. So I linked a Word document. This is where they would cite their sources. I, in my example, I just uh, linked the Word document of their sources. That isn't what the kids would actually do, but to save me a little time, I just linked any any document, which happened to be the sources. We'll see if it opens up here in just a minute. And it should. And it's missing. There it is. So you can, of course, see they would have some um, sources cited, and they would have a list of what they used for their project. And you can also do a video on the side also. So, man, take, take a look at this. This is a, a great resource. And I think you could use it in lots of areas, probably from second grade all the way up you know, through middle school or even high school. Um, so take a look at it. Thanks for watching.